My name is uh, Jonathan Mark Sherman, and I am the book writer for uh, Bob and Carol and Ted and Alice, the musical. Adapting the movie for stage uh, has been, um, for me, sort of Hippocratic, uh, first and foremost. The writing of the movie is so extraordinary that I thought, uh, first, let's do no harm. And um, saying, if, if we're getting rid of anything, what, you know, we better have a really, really good reason for it, because having now read drafts of the screenplay and um, seen the movie you know many many times and done a lot of research about the period um, there's there's a reason for pretty much everything that's in there one thing that's interesting if you go back and watch the movie is uh, that it's it is a very intimate piece um, although there are sort of three um, set pieces uh, at an institute a club and um, a park in a parking lot uh, where there's lots of people. It really is a movie about Bob and Carol and Ted and Alice. And so the idea of how small could we make it um, uh, was something from early on uh, that uh, I was really interested in and Scott Elliott, who brought me in, was really interested in. Movies do that really well. Um, let's try and go internal a little bit more. Yeah, I, w I just really wanted to uh, make something that Paul Mazursky, particularly were he alive, uh, would enjoy. Jill Mazursky has been uh, an angel uh, to this project. She has been so kind, so generous. Um, she has uh, told us that her father w would be thrilled. Um, she has checked in at every part of the process um, and uh, she gave me uh, my favorite note I've ever gotten, which was that she said, this is kind of um, actually a note for my dad that I always wanted to give him, but um, I can't, so I'm giving it to you, which is that I think he and Larry Tucker, his co-writer of the screenplay, didn't quite understand how birth control pills worked. Um, and uh, so maybe that moment in the scene between um, uh, Ted and Alice in their bedroom, uh, you might want to take a look at that. and. Um, and so we have uh, adjusted accordingly um, because uh, I think she's absolutely right. <laughs>